but I'll tell you what, I to some extent feel, uh, I don't know if it's ossified, but I am so angered at the turn that some of this has taken that I've chosen, chosen to drop out of the debate. For instance, I find it insane that at places like airports, Somebody can't say, well, you know, 17 of the 19 guys are Saudis. Oh. They were in here on uh, work permits. Exactly. Like, maybe if somebody like that comes through the airport, we can oh. pay a little attention to them. And immediately, everybody, it's another freedom of speech issue. They all hit it's you with a profiling thing? Is it? I am for profiling. I scream about this on my show every week because I'm always in airports and I come back. And, you know, I was telling a story this week on the show. The guy who helps me through the airports in New York helped uh, a 70-year-old blind man and they pulled him out of line for a random check the whole deal shoes oh one other thing it was ray charles it was ray charles ray charles got wow. checked or yeah ray, i'm not kidding ray charles uh i remember watching it at the emmys and they had the pre thing and the what, a guy from security bragging i love when people brag about how stupid they are <laughs> We checked Kelsey Grammer the same as we checked everybody else. Well, congratulations being such a fucking moron. Because, you know, Kelsey Grammer, that's who we're looking for. He's been undercover for all these years as Frazier. But that's really the terrorist. Everyone knows you, the one you got to keep your eye on is David Hyde Pierce. Uh, <laughs> huh? Something there. Now, I'm very profiling. but You know why the, they don't have profiling? is because they can't have profiling because the people they hire can't handle it. If you had smart people who were paid a good wage, a secret service for the people like they have in Israel, they could handle it because it's a de de detective job. But you can't give it to the GED hopeful <laughs> with the long nails and the, you know. Now,